welcome back to a look at your weather here. Quick look at your weekend planner looking like a beautiful one. Temperatures may be warming up just a little bit for your Sunday, but for the most part, it is looking like a sunny one. The more comfortable day is definitely going to be tomorrow. Seeing that high of 79, plenty of sunshine, and still seeing that northerly flow, which is bringing in some cooler air for the north. As the north got some snow these last couple of days, so definitely some cooler breeze with that. But then we'll see the winds are going to be switching when we see that actually the winds are from the north on Saturday and then on Sunday from the south. So bringing more of that tropical air from the Gulf, making those temperatures warm up just a tad bit, not feeling too humid, more along the lines of just that warm sunshine with some warmer air, not that stickiness that we'll be feeling like we have in last week. So just another comfortable day in store for us for this weekend. So definitely a weekend to get out and enjoy what we're seeing for high temperatures today. So this was 79, 79 in Laurel as well, seeing a 77 in Jackson. And then the more north we got, those temperatures were a little bit cooler. There were some frost advisories just in um, I think it was just north of Tennessee area. So the cold air is definitely bringing some frost advisories to areas, but we're still staying fairly warm overnight, still staying in those 50s. So frost won't be anything a word for us for at least the next couple of weeks as well. Dew points sitting into the 50s, just under the 60s, seeing 59 in Meridian right now. And we'll see that these might try to stay in the mid 60s as we move through the, this weekend as those winds will switch. But for the most part, it's still going to be looking like a fairly nice weekend with these dew points trying to stay just a tad bit cooler. What we're seeing is that this high pressure system is really allowing for those winds. So we're seeing that northerly fall come down, looking like some showers trying to make its way through, but are dissipating before it gets to our area. So don't worry, you are going to be staying dry tonight. But we're going to see that this cold uh, front is going to be keeping that high pressure really localized in the southeast, allowing for that maybe to start seeing that uh, southerly flow once this high pressure moves off, which will bring in those chances for some showers as we move into next week. Tonight we'll get down to 56 degrees, staying fairly clear overnight, and especially when you wake up up tomorrow morning. Lots of sunshine and temperatures quickly warming up by 10 a.m. Seeing 65 degrees, but still having lots of sun. Just a few clouds passing on by and no chances for some rain tomorrow. Definitely going to be holding off till at least next week. These are, this is your hourly planner for Sunday, so a little bit warmer of a day. Having that feel like temperature there just under the 90s, actual at 88, but still another beautiful day. That sunshine there, just a few more clouds increasing with that moisture when we have those winds that are switching. Taking a look at this fall foliage. So this is what when we see like those fall colors, the pretty colors on the trees, we are going to be seeing that it is going to be holding off just a little bit longer. We're seeing that this is the estimate for October 22nd, seeing that we're still in this patchy area of just seeing a few trees that are changing colors. But hopefully by the end of the month, we'll see that this partial will start making its way in and then see that we'll be in that high seat part of the season, seeing those colors changing and seeing that kind of right around that Thanksgiving time in the perfect time to be feeling nice. So here's that look at that seven days. So there's those showers that I was talking about Monday, seeing definitely going to be a rainier day on Sunday and then into Tuesday as well. Clouds going to be staying fairly overcast and going to be keeping those temperatures plenty under average. There's only a high of 70 on Wednesday, but still we'll get out. We'll enjoy this weekend, do some fall activities and just enjoy this comfortable weather before the temperatures really try to take a dip on us and making it feel yeah, it looks like they're dipping uh, the first part of next week and yeah. just uh, dipping out on us too, a little too the sun too. is dipping out on us. yeah <laughs> yeah no it, it, it's doing all it's going to keep all its work on this weekend making sure that you can enjoy your weekend off and then the cool weather will be when we're inside and off to worry about okay it. Mm. I like that yes it's always good to have the weekends nicer it's a yeah. good plan yeah thank you mother nature yeah <laughs>